This is the typical early spring landscape with several robins singing, some giving their calls, a couple of white-throated sparrows, and a number of cardinals also singing. The robin is one of the most common species here and very vocal. It's important to learn their song as a benchmark and comparison point for lots of other really important species like scarlet tanager, rose-breasted grosbeak, even red-eyed vireo, and other songs like goldfinch and so on. Listen for the evenness of the phrases so the rhythm is very even. But within each phrase there are many fast pitch changes so that the elmas are often very short or have several pitch changes in a very short period of time. That's quite different than some of these other species which we'll hopefully encounter later in our trip. This next sequence shows off the fast pitch changes that's characteristic of the robin. And it first plays at normal speed and then I slowed it down to half speed. So it's easier to hear the structure of the elements. This final example compares the Northern Cardinal song with the American Robin Call. This is a fast version of the Cardinal song, and even though it's fast, the slurs are very smooth and simple. The Robin Call actually has two parts to the phrase, two elements. One is a very fast chip-like note, and the other is a lower slur made by the other syrinx. So it sounds more complex. Notice also that the cardinal song gradually falls in pitch and the robin's call is very even. 